What a very clever link that was. Eight legs, haha, <laughs> from eight legs to eight legs, yes indeed. On one creature here, the tropical tentweb spider, of which we have spoken much over the last little while. But uh, what I'm going to point out again is that the tropical tentweb spider has got all of her egg sacs in a row there waiting to hatch. And that's just happened. They're all sort of setting up, I think, for breeding, for hatching their eggs. And the little spiderlings are probably shortly to hatch. Unless they, uh, they may overwinter in those egg sacs. I'm not sure if that's what happens. I probably need to do a little bit more research to find out if they actually sit. They may hang exactly like that for the duration of the winter and then wait for the summer before they hatch. But uh, there are going to be a lot of spiderlings that come out of those eggs. I would foot say in excess of a hundred. For many people, of course, that would be the worst possible nightmare. Those little spiderlings, though, will be little more than a millimetre long, or uh, sort of um, a twenty. How do we describe a millimetre in inches? Uh, One twentieth, I guess, of an inch, plus minus. So they're tiny, tiny little things, and I think they'll probably find their own homes somewhere close by if they survive. I've definitely seen lots of big tropical tent web spiders webs like this that are surrounded by youngsters or certain, certainly much smaller ones. Then I think there's probably a male or two and I think uh, Seb's probably showing you maybe a male or two there. They're the smaller spiders and there'll also be some kleptoparasites that are stealing food and a whole little ecosystem going on just around this one tropical tentweb spider, which is the sort of apex predator of its kind, if you like. It really is a rather wonderful, wonderful web that she's created there. And you might just be able to notice a slight shake on the web. That is from every time Seb's heart beats, his leg moves slightly, which in turn moves the tree very slightly on which the tropical tempt web spider <laughs> is sitting. Is <laughs> 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 but it's very regular if you watch it. Dum, dum, dum. It's quite cool, actually. You can tell Seb's heartbeat from the shaking of the tropical tempt web spider's egg sacs. Fantastic stuff. I need to do a little bit more research into them because they are rather fascinating, but I'm afraid that's, I've told you just about the limits of my knowledge of the tropical tent web spider. Good.